Isn't the lilac fabulous? You look like a free chef. I love the gray. All the girls are wearing lilac. Yeah, well, I love the gray. It felt like a cloud. And you know I don't wear lilac. You wore a lilac sweater with a cat face on it on the cover of Seventeen magazine when I was at fat camp. Yeah, well, I got paid for that. And I was on horse tranquilizers. So why aren't I the maid of honor? Why is Emma the maid of honor? Because? What does that mean? I wasn't sure if you were even coming or if you'd make it. I wasn't sure if you had time for a fitting. Bullshit. It's a sorry. You take a bolt of cloth and wrap it around you. Jesus Christ. I've only been home for one day and I can't get a straight answer from anyone. What are you talking about? I'm talking about Dad offering me food every 10 seconds. Dad offers Irish hunger strikers food every 10 seconds. No. He has to know where I am and what I'm doing all the time because he's never resolved his old trust issues. Leave Dad alone. I'd love to, but he won't let me. I feel him watching me all the time. And you, and Carol too. I feel like the visiting sociopath. What are you people waiting for me to do? Burn the house down? That was a mattress. And it was a sleepover. God, I should just get hazmat tattooed on my forehead or something. Stop. You're acting like a harpy. Is being my maid of honor that important to you? I didn't think you actually gave a shit. How could you fucking say that to me? Jesus, you want me to ask Emma to step down as my maid of honor. <laughs> Fine. The crown is yours. Then Emma will just have another reason to hate me. Like she needed one. It's not about you. It's about sisterhood. Sisterhood conquers all. And bludgeons all and pillages all and leaves all for dead. So the gray is not an option.